epilepsy is a diagnosis that comes with lot of apprehensions and anxiety people think epilepsy is a disease of madness lunacy it can spread from one to the other it will impede life but that is farthest from true epilepsy happens because there is a leakage of current between brain cells and the current in the brain spreads to large number of cells at one time which causes hyperactivation of the brain which leads to abnormal body movements contortions clenching of jaw noise from the throat and frothing from mouth sometimes epilepsy can manifest as just unconsciousness or the child becoming still or it can manifest as abnormal movement of one part of the body also epilepsy is very common in children and is cause of great anxiety to parents epilepsy has many causes which include sometimes injuries to the brain that happen during birth some genetic causes lack of maturation of brain sometimes young children less than 5 years can get seizures because fever lowers the seizure threshold and it is not epilepsy it is called febrile seizures in children sometimes epilepsy happens as a sequela to injuries to the brain or because of infection by tb or tapeworm infestation of the brain which is treatable the good part is epilepsy does not preclude a child's ability to study or to develop or to make friendships with other children or to play most children with epilepsy are otherwise normal and it's a very very common disease it doesn't spread from child to child and good part is that we have very good medicines available today which can control and treat epilepsy we have a fear that the medicine will cause my child to become mentally slow not able to study but that's not true most children with modern medicines are able to study they usually do not cause great damage to the child's liver kidney brain or any other body organs and they can be taken safely and we have multiple medicines available to suit each child's needs so if your child has epilepsy don't be afraid don't get lost in myths treat with your doctor who will make an appropriate diagnosis of the cause of your epilepsy and then give him appropriate medicine but the greatest good news is that most children will outgrow their epilepsy as the brain matures and after adolescence most children will be able to stop their medications and live a epilepsy free life the only important thing is right diagnosis right drug and the drug to be taken properly according to doctor's instructions at the right time thank you Thank you.